certain people and two that lived nearby didn't even know mm -hmm. it was here. Being outside and about with the community but also in wildlife, it just lifts your spirits. It makes you feel a little bit taller and a little bit more respected as well working in the local environment. You see the public walking past and saying thank you for your work. So yeah. take your time and precision is key on that job. By the end they can't believe what they've done. They've a Q, a AQA level two they never thought they could get. So we're really proud of them by the end. The money may only last 18 months, but it's hoped the project's legacy could last years. Sally Bowman, BBC East Midlands Today, Nottingham. Oh, lovely. Well, allotment holders always want to know what the weather's doing, don't they? And for all the information, Kay, you know, yeah, don't you? Yeah, it's been good growing weather recently, hasn't it? You can't complain of a lack of rainfall, that's for sure. And we've had the other important ingredients of the warmth and the sunshine today. The uh, sunflowers are doing well this year, aren't they? Did see quite a bit of cloud this morning, but that only gave us a very colourful sunrise. It was certainly worth the early start. We've had some really beautiful sunrises over the past couple of weeks or so. And the cloud didn't hang around, did it? We uh, saw that breaking up and we've had some lovely blue sky today and the warmth to match as well. Temperatures reached 23 degrees. So a nice little taste of summer for us today. Now there's still the chance of a sprinkly shower this evening, but uh, otherwise we're dry. We'll keep the clear skies for much of the night as well. The winds will stay light, so we could be seeing a little bit of patchy mist forming by the end of the night. But temperatures are staying into double figures, so a minimum of around 11 to 12 degrees. Now tomorrow, it's a nice looking start to the day there will be some sunshine early on but this time it's not going to last because we will see the cloud increasing fairly quickly through the morning so it will turn greyer as the day wears on now we should stay dry for most of the day tomorrow but by the end of the day into the evening we'll see some bits and pieces of showery rain starting to head their way in but temperature wise tomorrow despite a lack of sunshine getting up to around 21 degrees with southwesterly winds now that cloud and rain is linked to a weather front which will be pushing its way in tomorrow evening and tomorrow night. It's quite a weak affair so it won't bring too much in the way of rainfall and it should have cleared by Thursday morning. Still some uncertainty as just to where it will lie but at the moment it looks like it will be to the south of us on Thursday so some lovely sunshine around. The possibility of that cloud pushing back in into the afternoon across southern parts but a decent looking day for Thursday. We're generally dry with some sunshine and those uh, temperatures getting back up to around 21 or 22 degrees. Now there is the chance that we could be seeing a couple of showers into Friday and Saturday but otherwise not a bad outlook at all. We're going to stay mostly dry. There'll be some nice sunshine around and temperatures staying at around 19 or 20 degrees. Lovely. I like that outlook. It's marvellous, isn't it? That's all from us for this evening. Join Emily for the late news at 10.30 but from all of us, goodbye. <laughs>